Hey everybody, it's me Tracy and I wanted to pop on for another quick review. As you guys know, um, I have been testing out Tree Naturals hair products. I started out in September using her hair products with just the shampoo bar and the conditioner bar of which I'm still using. So um, I started using those in September and you know I've been pretty much using them weekly. Um, and I really, really like the results and how my hair has been coming out. So I think that they work fabulous. But that's not what the video is about today because I, it's still on Tree Naturals. But I decided to take advantage of her 20% off sale that she had not too long ago and pick up a couple of more products. So I picked up three products, which I picked up her leave-in conditioner and two styling products, the flaxseed gel as well as the hair milk. Normally, I don't like hair milks. I tend to stay away from them because I hadn't found one that I liked. But we're going to talk about, you know, my first impressions of what I felt about the Tree Naturals hair uh, milk. So, after I shampooed my hair with the solid bar and then conditioned with another, her conditioning solid bar, um, I left the conditioner on my hair for about 10 minutes. I didn't do a deep condition today because I just didn't feel like it. Um, and my hair wasn't feeling dry. So, yeah, I just conditioned it, left it on for 10 minutes, and then, um, after that, rinsed it out. And then I followed with the leave-in conditioner. This is her rice flour and shea leave-in conditioner. I really like this. It's not too thick. There are some companies out there where their leave-in conditioners are on the thick side. And um, I'm not a fan of the thick leave-in conditioners. But this was really nice. It has a nice consistency. It's a little bit thicker than a lotion, um, but lighter than a cream. So it goes on really nice. And I put it on damp hair because I was undecided if I wanted to do a roller set today or a wash and go. So these products went on damp hair. And I really do like this. It has a really nice um, light smell. I smell, the main thing that I smell when I smell this leave-in is Melaleuca tea tree oil. Um, yeah, that's the main thing that I smell. I don't smell like anything floral or flowery, but it's nice and it's not lingering. So that's great because I tend to be sensitive to certain smells sometimes. So I really can appreciate the fact that this is very light and it doesn't linger in your hair, but it works great at as a leave-in for moisturization. So my hair felt very moisturized after putting this on and raking it through. Then I followed with this. This is her Revive Hair Milk Honey Fruit and Flowers. I love the way that this smells. It's very lightweight and it kind of smells like it reminds me of like a herbal tea. I didn't know what to expect with this product because I thought it was going to be watery because it had a spray bottle. Um, but y'all, it's like a lotion. So that is the bomb. So let me tell you, about a few weeks ago, I was, you know, reminiscing about when I was younger, in my younger days, junior high, high school, and I used to do my hair. And I wore my hair natural back then, too, but I always, my go-to styles was like um, the one French braid down the middle or two French braids, you know, one on each side. I mostly wore my hair like that or in braids because I wore my hair natural for pretty much all of my life and until my adulthood. And then I just wanted to experience what it would be like to have straight hair. But for a long time, I just had, I was rocking my natural hair and my go-to product uh, for styling was pink lotion. How many of you guys have used pink lotion? <laughs> I used to love that because it was a moisturizer and um, it also would act as my styler. And so I was saying to myself a few weeks ago, I was like, dang, I wish that there was another product that was similar to pink lotion, but just had better ingredients. Put out, 
I have found it, you guys, with this Revive Hair Milk. This is so nice. It comes out like a lotion and um, it just goes through your hair really nicely. And so this is what I use to style my hair today. Um, it has several uses. You can use this as a curl refresher. You can use it just to moisturize your hair. You can use it as a styler. You can, you know, it has several, like five different uses that you can use this. And y'all, I just love this. So today I use this as my styler. And hello, these are my curls. My hair is still like damp. That's another thing I liked is that I was able to put these, her products on damp hair and get these type of results. So this is how my hair is looking. Love, love, love. Hello? So yeah, I am really feeling this. It doesn't feel like my hair is going to um, dry crunchy because it's almost dry. Um, it doesn't feel like it's going to dry crunchy or anything like that. And it feels nice and it's not heavy. It doesn't weigh down. It's not oily, um, but it is moisturizing. So yeah, and it's a styler. So I'm so happy to, that I picked this up because I was undecided. I almost didn't get this, um, hair milk, but I'm so glad that I picked it up. So yeah, y'all, have y'all tried any of her, these products that I'm talking about today, her hair milk or her leave-in conditioner or even her flaxseed gel? I also picked that up too, but I haven't tried it yet. So when I do try it, I'll come back and tell you guys what I think about the um, flaxseed gel. I'm excited to try that out, but yeah, I just wanted something a little bit lightweight and simplistic. Um, so I didn't want to do the gel this time, but yeah, you guys, I'm like so happy. Um, testing out these products. It's just really great. They are very good and it's a small business, woman owned, black owned. And yeah. So if you have not checked her out, go on her website. She is great at answering questions and, you know, just if you have any concerns, she will address them. So that's the other thing I like. She's very customer focused. So, all right, you guys, I just wanted to come on and show you guys my hair and talk a little bit about these products. And uh, I'll continue doing these videos as I continue uh, testing out the Tree Naturals hairline. All right, you guys, I'll talk to you on the next one. Have a beautiful weekend and uh, make it a great day. Bye for now. Oh, and if you like this content, give me a thumbs up. And yeah, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you'll know when you're getting new, when I upload new videos. All right, I'll talk to you guys on the next one. Bye for now.